Hello family, grace to you. Once again, this is Greg coming to you from faithsmessenger.com. The title of today's message is Faith Comes by Hearing. Faith Comes by Hearing. There are precious promises for us, the Christian, in God's Word. There's a great benefit to reading God's Word. There's great benefit to prayer. There are great, there is great benefit to attending church and, and religious services and fellowshipping with the brethren. But the deep things of God, the things that will impact your spirit, most of the time are below the surface. They have to be sought after. They have to be searched for. And it takes time to dig and, and ferret them out. I love going to the beach. And there's a beach in Texas called Padre Island National Seashore. It's one of our largest, our longest beaches in this country. This beach is 70 miles long. Now we can go to the beach, enjoy the sun, enjoy the water, have a great time with our family and friends. And we can leave that beach that day rejoicing about the good time that was had by all. And that's great. That's fine. But on any given day on that beach, there have been tons of jewels and rings and coins and, and things that are left, that are dropped, that are lost on that beach. Now, when, when you leave your car in the parking lot and you walk out onto that beach, you don't see them. It's just a pristine, beautiful beach. Those jewels that are there underneath the surface have to be sought after. You have to go out there with an instrument, a metal detector, to go and sweep the surface and do some digging and do some plotting and actually look for the jewels and precious metals that are underneath the surface of that beach. Now, we, like I said, we could have enjoyed our day on the beach. I could have been lying right next to maybe six, seven inches down, uh, a precious stone of some sort, a rare coin of some sort, and I never realized it because I was lying on the surface. The same is true for the things of God. We can read the Word, we can, um, we can peruse its pages and gain some benefit out of it, but the deep things of God, the precious things of God, most of the time lie underneath the surface and they have to be searched out. That's where faith comes in. Faith comes by hearing. Don't fall into the trap that some have fallen into of thinking that faith comes by having heard. There's a big difference between having heard the word and hearing the word. Hearing the word is a continual thing that should take place for the rest of your life. But I've heard so many Christians say, oh, I heard that before on any given topic. Faith doesn't come by having heard. If faith came by having heard, all you would need to do is hear it one time and you'd have it. But I'm sure you can agree with me, that's far from the case. Faith comes by hearing, not by having heard. So I want to encourage you today to dig under the surface of God's Word. It's great, like I said, it's great to read it, it's great to peruse it, it's great to go to church, but the, the, the life-changing power of God's Word lies underneath the surface. You need to hear it, mull it over, think about it, meditate on it, mutter it, get that Word into your heart. Put some work into it, and you'll find that those jewels, those precious jewels underneath the surface, once found, are life-changing. So I want to leave you with that, and I want to thank you for joining me. If you are a fellow Christian YouTuber, I invite you to join our YouTube community at micro-ministries.com. And what our community is about, we are a group of Christian YouTubers that have banded together to help get one another traffic to our YouTube channels. We also support, encourage, and we offer a great environment for you to grow and get exposure for your channel. Once again, you're welcome to join us at micro-ministries.com. Now this is a, a uh, invitation only group, so you'll need an invitation. So email me at faithsmessenger at gmail.com and I'll get that invitation right over to you. 
I'd also like to invite those who have not already to subscribe to our YouTube channel and by doing so you will receive notifications when videos such as this one are posted. And lastly, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to our blog at facemessenger.com and by doing so you will receive notifications when new blog posts are made. So with that, I want to leave you with a question. Regardless of what you're going through today, in your search for circumstances, I want to ask you, is anything impossible for our God? Have a great day, family. I love you, and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.